everyone. So today I'm going to show you how to clean your makeup brushes. So everything I've got here is what you will need. I have a real special device here which you can buy, but I'm going to show you firstly the really simple way to clean them. So I've got some Johnson's Baby shampoo here. No more tears. <laughs> this is brilliant. It's really cheap. It's like two quid a bottle and there's loads in there. It probably lasts you a good few months. You don't really need to go and buy expensive brush cleaner. This really does the job and it really helps to protect your brushes too. So I've got a bowl of warm water here. Take your dirty brush, as you can see. This is supposed to be a white brush, but it has blue eyeshadow all over it. Now this is the simple way of doing it. Put a little bit of your baby shampoo, wet the brush, and then just in your hand, just really rinse around and take off all the product. Can you see that foaming up and see how it's turned blue because that was the eyeshadow that was on the brush. Rinse it off and just keep going until it's really clean. Rinse your hands and start again. For a real deep clean, I'm going to use this little contraption here and it's not an oven glove, no. <laughs> it's actually by Sigma and it's a special glove to wash your brushes. What you'll see is it has different areas on it. Let's say wash, rinse, define, and then if it's for the face, so that means if they're face brushes like foundation brushes, blusher brushes, then this is perfect. Turn it over and it says eyes. So this is for smaller brushes, your eye brushes, your lip brushes, even your concealer brushes sometimes depending how small they are. And it has different textures on it and that's going to clean the brushes so deeply and so quickly. Honestly, it's so brilliant. You can get them online, just search Sigma Brush Cleaning Glove. And it's the same concept, apart from you're not getting lots of product in your hand. I find my hands get really, really dry if I just do the last process that you've just seen. But when I use this glove, obviously it's protecting my hand, which is great. It also means that I can clean more than one brush at once, and it's exactly the same process. All you do is you take your baby shampoo, you just need a tiny bit. I'm going to do a foundation brush, so I've got it on the face side. I'm just going to wet my brush to start with in circular motions. Just go on to the, the wash section. It's so self-explanatory, it's brilliant. And you can see how dirty the area is becoming. That's because of obviously the foundation on the brush. Then you can rinse it just on this section here. So all the different textures, what they're doing is they're deep cleaning the brush and they're getting all of the dirty product out. Then you can refine it on this section and by now you should see that there's absolutely no product in your brush. And then to keep the shape of the brush and to get all the excess water out, you use this area and just squeeze it out. And then what you do is put it on a, a towel and leave it to dry overnight. So I'm going to take a eyeshadow brush. I've turned the glove over now, so I've got it on the eye section. Exactly the same process, tiny bit, literally the tiniest drop of baby shampoo. Wet your brush. See all that dirt that's coming out of the brush? Just like so. Give it another rinse, then do it on the rinse section. We're still getting quite a lot of product out, which is great because that means you're really deep cleaning it. And then on the refine section, we're still getting more product out. So if you still find that, just repeat. See how much less there is now? Rinse, no product now. And then just squeeze in between because remember that's keeping the shape of your brush. It's so important. You don't want it to, your brush to be splaying when you're using it. So by doing this, it's just going to keep it in perfect shape. And then again, on a towel to dry overnight. The final thing I'm going to show you is just how I clean two brushes at once. Very simple. Always do two of similar brush, similar brush size. Just going to use blusher brushes. Again, a little bit. Just like so. If you've got loads of brushes like me, this just saves you a little bit of time. And it still cleans them as effectively too. Rinse it off and refine. Squeeze that water out. And that's it, that's how I clean my brushes. I really recommend investing in one of the Sigma brush cleaner gloves. I've had it for about a year now. I think they're around 25 pounds. Obviously, if you just wanna use a Johnson's baby shampoo, then great, that's a couple of quid and you'd only need to buy that every probably three to four months, depending again how often you brush them. So enjoy cleaning your brushes. I find it quite fun actually using this. <laughs> and thanks so much for watching and see you again next time. Show you what you wanna see